Morgan Freeman has publicly apologized after being charged with sexual harassment. Morgan Freeman has published a press statement Thursday in which he made public apologies after being charged with sexual harassment from eight women. The American actor has become the latest star in the entertainment industry that has been accused of inappropriate behavior following the Weinstein scandal. Yet, several dozen people contacted by CNN have talked about the American actor's flawless professional behavior. Anyone who knows me or has worked with me knows that I am not a person who would intentionally want to hurt or make someone feel embarrassed. I apologize to anyone who has felt embarrassed said Morgan Freeman in that press statement. In total, of several dozen people questioned by CNN and who collaborated with the 80-year-old actor, eight said they were harassed, and eight others said they had witnessed inappropriate behavior on the part of the star. A young production assistant, whose name was not revealed by CNN, who worked on Going in Style, a 2015 comedy starring Morgan Freeman, Michael Caine, and Alan Arkin, said she had to bear a number of unwanted touches and comments from the American actor during the shooting. She also says that Morgan Freeman was also commenting on how she was dressed, touching her palms in the lumbar region, and sometimes making her massage in her lower back. He tried to lift my skirt and asked me if we were wearing intimate underwear, she revealed. Alan then commented on something and asked him to stop. Morgan was very scared and did not know what to say, the young woman added. A top performer of Now You See Me, a production movie in 2012 starring Morgan Freeman, reported similar actor behavior. She asserts that Freeman has sexually assaulted her, but also other performers making some comments about their bodies. The women who accused Morgan Freeman of sexually harassing and inappropriate behavior have worked with the American actor both on shooting platforms and in his film production company, Revelations Entertainment. They say they had to change their way of dressing when they knew Freeman was about to be around because they wanted to avoid such behavior. All the applicants said they did not file a complaint against the actor and most of them said they did not do so because they were afraid of losing their jobs. Morgan Freeman founded Revelations Entertainment in collaboration with Laurie McCreary in 1996. Among the company's creations are films such as Invictus, along came a Spider and TV series Madam Secretary broadcast by ABC. Former employees of the company said the studio had a toxic environment. Six former employees from Revelations Entertainment said they had witnessed such behaviors from the American star, including sexually suggestive comments and unsolicited touch. Morgan Freeman was married to Jeanette Adair Bradshaw between 1967 to 1979. The actor married in 1984 with Myrna Colley Lee, whom he divorced in 2010. Morgan Freeman is one of Hollywood's most reputed actors with a career spanning over five decades. His main roles in movies such as Driving Miss Daisy and Shawshank Redemption in the late 1980s and early 1990s turned him into a world-famous celebrity. He won the Oscar for Best Supporting Actor for his Million Dollar Baby, 2004, and received four other Academy Award nominations. He gave his voice for several productions including as a narrator of Oscar-winning documentaries such as The Long Way Home and March of the Penguins. After the outbreak of the Harvey Weinstein scandal, a film producer fallen into disgrace after being accused of harassment and sexual assault by about 100 women, many film industry figures have been publicly accused of abusive sexual behavior. Among them are producer Brett Ratner, actors Kevin Spacey, Jeffrey Tambor, Steven Seagal and Dustin Hoffman, and French director Luc Besson. Besson, 